Hi guys, today we will be teaching you guys how to play one of Philippines' traditional games, Hunka. When she was younger, our mom used to play it a lot, and it gave her some very nice and good memories. So now our mom wants us to learn it as well. I love playing Hunka because... It is a really fun game. It's very time consuming though. And while I'm bored, I play it with my sisters to pass the time. When is this child? How to play Sunka. This is the Sunka board. Each row holds seven small holes and that the two big holes at each end serve as the player's base. To set up the game, you put seven stones in each small hole. The small holes in front of you is your territory, and the big hole on your left is your base. Opposite holes are your opponent's territory. The other big hole on your right is your opponent's base. You play the game by picking up the pebbles in one hole and and travel across the board. Well, as you travel across the board, you drop a pebble in each hole, including your base. But you do not put a pebble in your opponent's base. Goal of the game is to have more pebbles in your base than the opponent's. Is. To start your game, you rock, paper, scissors to decide who will be the first person to make their move. The winner will get their turn first. You can pick which hole you want to start with. When your last pebble lands in your base, you can pick another the hole to pick up. If your last pebble drops in a hole with, with, with other pebbles, you continue your turn by picking the other pebbles up. Your turn continues as long as you have pebbles. Every time your last pebble ends up in your base, you can pick another one up. You lose your turn when you drop your last pebble into an empty hole. If you die in your territory and there's pebbles on the other side, you can eat the pebbles on the other side while taking the pebble on your side too. When your last pebble drops on your opponent's side, you simply die and lose your turn. Hmm. The game ends when one player has no pebbles on their territory. If your opponent's side has run out of pebbles, you can take all the pebbles on your side and you will be the first person mm -hmm. to start the next round. Whoever has the most pebbles in their base is Bye -bye. the winner. Bye, thanks for watching.